just a quick look at what we've done here with this weather wall. The first thing is, this came with a circuit diagram that was about, you know, I got it blown up. So, it tells you basically what you need to know. That actually tells you down there what you need to know. So, the lugs I had, or have I should say, are basically go to here. They got rings on them that are fairly large. So, um, I couldn't get anything with the right heavy crimp that I wanted. So I got a heap of these brass washers. So everything's all secure. Now I've bent the active away from everything else. You can't really see it, but I've got quite a decent, this is dead by the way, I've got quite a decent clearance between active and everything else. And um, there's the neutral and there's the earth. So the earth, what I did, I actually took all this right apart because you probably can't see much, but it's all held together with stacks of nuts and a, and a bolt. And it was all loose. The whole assembly was loose. If I just steady this camera here. The whole assembly was loose with regards to the chassis. And that's the chassis ground. So I've got two of those brass washers on each one of these. So underneath there, there's two brass washers. Same with that. So um, it's all secure. Nothing can move around except the fact that that flexes. Same with this. And... Uh, same with that, everything's tight. Everything's probably overdone. I know it's over and above what they would have done from the factory. I got a bit of a star washer that I didn't put back. Anyway, the weather wall guy. I can't remember what your name is if you're watching, g'day. This is vintage weather wall, 1980. So the unit this replaced was from 1987 and was had a Siam compressor, industries compressor. This here, as you've seen in a previous video, is Mitsubishi Heavy Industries, Japan. So, made in Japan. Absolutely fabulous reciprocating compressor. So, this is the most elaborate this unit has in it, basically. I'll explain what all this does in a previous video. Oh, sorry, a previous video, a, um, a subsequent video. Don't you love no editing? Anyway, catch ya.